Yeah, look, we're in the HPC and UL. We're just 19s and 20s, but our whole summer age grade programme is up and running and going for the last three weeks. This is our second week as a group of 19s and 20s together. Um, so we're just prepping, I suppose, 19s for Interpros and 20s for Development Games come September. It's a good time to get, I suppose, work on our on our cornerstones as we call them, um, the cornerstones of the game, a real good um, building week for that going into games. They live like a pro for a, want of a better word, they eat like a pro, they have to learn how to cook for themselves, cook breakfast in the morning, get up early, um, all follow I suppose a timetable as such really and then obviously we get an education block in with them um, when they stay over so there's massive benefit to them through Carl Sheridan from uh, uh, sports psychology point of view, also journaling from Paul Gallen, things like that. So we get massive benefits of that when they're in here and they're hands on with us. We weren't able to use HPC last year, so it's a lot different, uh, especially seeing all the seniors inside in the gym and whatever. The gym's obviously a lot better, but uh, even the lounge and when you can just sit down instead of sitting in a dressing room all day, it's easy to put your feet up. Last year, especially, like because I did in place in your cup last year, so I didn't really know any of the lads. So when I came in, you just made friends with them, and then it's good because you can play whatever and you can hammer into each other during the cup games, and then after you know, be able to talk about it and you can have a bit of a laugh after with them. Yeah, so development for the first phase here would be a massive focus for us. So develop the skills so the players are able to play that game. And then we start to, I suppose, go towards the performance side of the things and the team side of things of building our, our structures around that. Some of the boys are, are capped internationals and actually five lads away playing sevens this weekend. So, you know, it's great for them, but it's always great to put on a Munster jersey and it's always great to, I suppose, try and better the, the, the the talent in Munster from a rugby point of view and it's always great to work with fellas that are driven and um, have the appetite to, to go.